I am Lucy Benson Brown, and I'm the writer and director of Radio Silence. So Radio Silence is a film about a kind of a world where significant change has happened. Um, the population's kind of halved. People are bound to their dwellings. They don't leave their houses for. They don't go outside. Um, and essentially, one character finds a key to the outside world and sort of ventures outside after being inside for a really long time. So my, I co-directed it with my friend Joe, um, and during lockdown we kind of put out a brief to writers. And the brief was that they had to write a character that hadn't left wherever they were for a long period of time. And so we had a few submissions, and then Joe and I also wrote some stuff. And in the end we had a male character and a female character and two completely different stories. And then we found a way to like merge them together. And then that, the result of that was the, was the film, basically. Uh, the visual style, because it was made in lockdown, we didn't want it to be directly connected to the pandemic, but it sort of has like a kind of nuclear undertone. So we were super inspired by like Chernobyl uh, and the sort of like even the color palette is sort of directly st taken from Chernobyl. Um, so that was the kind of, yeah, that was the kind of visual style of the film. So even like, our initial production designer was from, uh, she from, she's from like, I think she was ex-Soviet Union country, so a lot of the like emblems and stuff that she was looking at had that kind of Soviet Union feel, all the kind of branding and stuff on the props had that sort of reference. It's subtle, but I think that that's kind of where it came from. That's kind of the visual, the visual like style. It's been, like, it's been great to be here. It's, um, I've loved watching a lot of the films today and yesterday, and also I've got a lot of friends here, so it's been nice to kind of catch up with old university friends. Um, and I'm quite nervous about people seeing the film, especially since my friends are quite like critical. <laughs> but um, no, it's gonna be great. And uh, I'm quite looking forward to seeing it big because I've only ever really seen it on a laptop. Um, so I'm looking forward to like seeing the mistakes and seeing like the things I don't like about it, like blown up. I think like that's because, yeah, I just said to Dan, my editor who's here, I'm like, we're gonna just notice all the things that we don't like, but like it's on a very, very large scale. That's a very British answer. Uh, right, cool. Thank you very much. Thanks.